vending machine scotches. Nick Drinks. Hey everyone, this is Nick Britsky for Nick Drinks. We are here live at the studio interviewing Joe Hakim, who is the host of Herd Podcast, as well as the chief marketing officer for Ackroyd Scottish Bakery. Hello. Hey. How's it going? Good. Great. So I brought you here because we, when I went to London, I actually purchased some of these vending machine scotches. Vending mas machine scotch. <laughs> vending yeah. machine mm -hmm. sc yeah, scotches. <laughs> so there's a bar, there's a hotel that has three bars okay. right next to the vending machine. All right. And so you have to go inside, get the token, and then go in and pop it. And the bar doesn't mind that you're not buying the booze from them? You are buying the booze from them. Oh, you're it's... just buying from the vending machine. Oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay. So Whiskey Me is the company, and if you are in the England, I'm not sure if maybe all of Europe, you can actually buy these and they'll deliver them to you on a periodic basis. So wow. this is like a subscription club for whiskey as well. All right. So you want to pop one open? Yeah, let's do it. Now you're supposed to drink it right from the pouch. Just put it in a glass. What do you do? Well, if it's like a old. sippy pouch, like for kids. <laughs> I know, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> Expect apple applesauce in here, not scotch. But well, let's, let's try. Hold on. Don't pour it all in. Don't pour it. Let's okay. do a cheers in the back. Like cheers. Let's do a pouch right. chug. Hmm. Oh, that, that's definitely Lafroid. Wow. Woo. So we were talking about how much is in here. I feel like you have more than me. Oh, no, I don't know. You just have more air. Because this one definitely deflated a little. I think it was partially the air airline ride. Okay. What do you call that? A plane? A plane, yeah. yep. <laughs> I'll taste this one. Oh, yeah, that's... You want to drink they're both, they're both very good. Um, this is a great idea. Mm -hmm. um, that's Highland for sure. Yeah, these are, these are yeah. fantastic. So I think the, the problem with doing this in the U.S., is it's all the laws. Yep. And I, if you could prove that they were 21, maybe they would let you do this inside. But definitely not outside like it was. Yeah, these are great. Thanks, thanks for sharing this with me. So um, we got some footage that we took while we were there. So uh, we're going to play that now and see how the whiskey vending machine works. Joe, cheers. <laughs> cheers. Thanks for coming out. Thank you. Nick Drinks reporting from London, England. We are here at the Napoleon Hotel checking out the whiskey vending machine. This is a vending machine that allows you to buy a number of different whiskeys here. It's actually not all the same whiskey. They're all variously different labeled across here so you can see what you're getting and try it out. You actually head upstairs to the Devil Darling cocktail bar and get yourself a token. This token costs you 795 uh, pounds, so that's roughly 10 or so dollars, and that allows you to get your own whiskey. Um, what's interesting as we've noticed about London is that there really aren't necessarily uh, open container laws. Uh, you can kind of be, you know, drunk and uh, disorderly, but if you walk around calmly with a, a little bag of whiskey right here, uh, you're totally fine. That's no big deal. So we're going to check this out. We're going to throw our coin in and we're going to see what happens. Let's find out. So that totally just worked. So here we have a Lefroy Lore single malt scotch, 48% ABV, um, 50 centiliters. Um, I guessing that's in the neighborhood of a, a little serving, so 50 milliliters, that sounds about right. And um, on the back, discover more about this month's dram with high definition video and distillery data at whiskey-me.com, as well as go through our social media channels. So there you can see you can log in and you can see all the various different uh, aspects that they have too. So um, this is very cool. Uh, Nick Britsky here checking out the, uh, at Napoleon Hotel, checking out their whiskey vending machine. Uh, definitely a success, a little bit of trouble getting that coin in, but uh, all's good. Cheers, everyone. So thanks for sticking around for the whole video. We got a little bit of bonus content for you. Uh, as I mentioned, Joe works at a Scottish bakery. He does the marketing there. Your main profit is the baked goods, right? Right, yeah, so we have a selection of savory and sweet baked goods. Um, we're more, ma massively known more for like our savory side, so, our meat pies are our most popular item. Um, these are black pudding, pork, and apple sausage rolls. So normally our sausage roll is just beef, uh, but you're trying them first. Cool. Yeah. Cool. Thank you. Sure. So this is a uh, um, what I would call like an approachable black pudding. So it's um, we use beef blood. Um, like and, there's uh, blood in here. Yeah. I don't want it. <laughs> um, <laughs> Jamaica pepper, which is kind of like an allspice, mm -hmm. um, salt. Uh, and then pork, pork fat, uh, and then some apples that mm -hmm. we've cut up to. Well, I mean, I, I think these taste great. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. the, the addition of apple was great. Uh, and uh, we're also going to have a pork and Stilton 
mm. uh, sausage roll that mm. we um, will be developing uh, in, the, in the next couple days. Oh, well, again, cheers. You already finished your... I finished my scotch. I'm sorry. You have to get some back here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, to find more information about Ackroyd's Bakery, you can find it at ackroydsbakery.com. Uh, shop.ackroydsbakery.com is our e commerce site, and um, Instagram, Facebook, all those things. Cool. And yeah. you can find Joe and I every week on Tuesday at Herd Podcast. So, cheers, everyone.